Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another edition of Telescope Man. Well, it's real short video. It's just really to give you a heads up if you happen to be a uh, amateur radio operator or a shortwave listener. Today and tomorrow <clears throat> uh, might be the days to get on the radio. There's a and what we call an ITU contest worldwide going on right now. And uh, what, what's happening is uh, hands from all over the world are trying to make contacts. So the bands are alive right now. I've made a few contacts. I uh, haven't heard a whole lot of DX. I did make a couple of contacts uh, to Hawaii. Uh, yeah, it's a little DX there, uh, but mostly it was signals from all over the USA. Uh, I'm going to kind of take a pause here on radio stuff for a little while, then come back later and see, uh, check some other bands and see if I can uh, pick up any uh, new DX uh, long distance contacts. Uh, to go with my 90 entities right now. I might be able to pick up a couple this weekend. Maybe. Anyway, I just wanted to give you a look at the screen and kind of show you uh, some of the contacts I've made this morning. So let's kind of switch over to uh, my QRZ page. And if you look at this page right here, uh, the most recent contacts, all on 20 meters, by the way. You can see some of the folks I've contacted this morning. Uh, you know, here's one of those uh, Hawaii contacts right here. Uh, coming in pretty good, too. Uh, very readable. And then last night, I was uh, basically doing a little practicing. Uh, again, here's that. Hawaii contact. But I was doing a little practicing last night and did manage to pick up uh, Puerto Rico, Australia, and Hawaii again. Uh, some of the contesters were just practicing last night to make sure their equipment was working before the contest started. So anyway, today is the day. Let me get you back off of here just for a second. And get you back over here. Today is the day if you want to you have a radio and you're not interested in contesting, I would still encourage you to turn it on and just go through the bands. Uh, it might surprise you uh, on how active they are, even though this is solar minimum. You know, like I've said in the past, uh, <clears throat> the bands are open to somewhere sometime during the day. Might not be where you want to actually make a contact, but at any particular time of the day, uh, the main bands of 10, 15, 20, and 40 are basically open somewhere, and they're probably open somewhere uh, long distance. Uh, but what happens is, uh, no one is calling on that band. They don't see any signals or hear any signals on a normal day, and they think the band is dead. Uh, if they would just go there and start calling CQ for a few minutes, might might surprise you on uh, who answers you when the band is dead. Anyway, that's all for today. Uh, I'm going to be back on the radio, probably do another video later on uh, and see what kind of DX I can uh, get a hold of today. Anyway, everybody be good. Clear Sky 73. Keep looking up to see the greatest show on earth right over your head every single night. Everybody be good. Get on the radio. Listen to these signals. See y'all later.